Welcome in to another crochet tutorial. Today I'm going to show you something so so easy and it is either loved or hated by people. There's not really much in between. Um, kind of like Pico I guess. You love it, you hate it. It is what it is. But this is a way to do an edging, an accent piece on your finished work when it just needs a little bit of something. This is one version. There are lots of different kinds and another time I will do another version, but this is probably the easiest. So you've got your completed scarf, blanket, shawl, skirt, top, yada, 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 yada. To make a fringe, take your yarn that you want your fringe in and have a guess at roughly how long you want your actual fringe to be. Double it. After you've doubled it, add about two inches, approximately. When you've got your full length, take your trusty scissors and snip. And make another few. So for this one, I'm going to do four strands personal taste you can do two three four depends how fluffy you want it really so when you've got your strands you then need to take the edge of your work so it doesn't matter where on the edge, um, if you're on a blanket. Obviously, if you're on something like a, a scarf, you start at one end and you work your way across, if you fancy. I mean, you don't have to, you know. But just for this instance, for this example, I'm just going to go smack bang in the middle. So you're going into any stitch that you're going with and at the halfway point of your fringe, grab it with your hook, pull it through. When it's pulled through, wrap it around your hook and pull through again and tighten. Ta-da! Fringe. And then when you finish, oh no, not when you finish. Do you know what? Let's do some more. Let's do some more before we finish. <laughs> So let's do about that long, add a couple of inches and I'll do a three on this one just to show you and then I'll do a two because of course they all come out slightly different. So there's my three. Now I'm not going to go right next to, I'm going to go a couple away. Just for this example, you may want to do it every one. You may want to do it every other one. You may just want to do it on the corners. Bring it through. Pull the yarn over your hook and bring it through again. And pull to tighten the knot. So there's a three. So let's do a two. Let's do a two. I'm going to say about that length. There and there. And a snip snip. And a couple away again. How many did I do? Two. So I'll do two away again. And at the halfway point, bring it through. So simple. And there we have one with two strands, 
one with three strands, one with four strands. And then all you need to do when you've completed your full fringe is play hairdresser. And just make sure all your fringe is equal. Ta-da! And that is how you do a really easy fringe. And I'll do another one another time. But for now, there we go. Love it or hate it. It's a fringe, baby. It's a fringe. <laughs> okay my time here is done until next week hopefully i will see you then for a stitch tutorial until then take care bye, -bye.